This was an energy practice that came to me because I was wanting to connect with my belly and do it in a very uh, relaxed and playful way because the more relaxed and lighter you are in your practices, the more you're going to get out of them. So this particular practice is centered around the year of the wood dragon, uh, this lunar new year, which is 2024. And so I just wanted to lead you through a guided practice to help you anchor into your body, get out of your head, and uh, lighten up and be a little playful with yourself. So the first thing you always want to do is get into a good comfy space. So make sure you have the doors closed, the windows, curtains closed, whatever it is you need to do to feel like you have a sacred boundaried space that you're not going to be disturbed. You just want to feel safe and cozy. So you do this practice, or I'm doing this practice sitting in a sitting position. So be in a a chair, preferably one that's, again, comfy for you, with your back resting against a cushion or support, your feet on the ground. Um, The first step in, in any practice I do is to... Just feel the back of my body against the cushions and the support. So I want you to just allow your awareness to travel from the back of your shoulders, your spine, your pelvic bowl, your thighs, your knees, calves, ankles, and feet, and down to the ground. Just allow your awareness to start to just familiarize itself with the body again, from the spine, to the seat, the legs, and the feet. You might want to take a deep breath in and out. As you move your awareness from your spine, seat, legs, and feet. On your inhale, breathe up. And exhale, spine, seat. Legs, feet. So adjust your posture if you need to at this point. Like scooch in a little bit with your sits bones. Just being sure that you're kind of in your right alignment for this. Maybe, maybe pull your chin back a little bit. That sometimes can help. Just kind of click that neck into place. And and if you can feel the crown chakra uh, at the top of your head, just kind of get aligned when you do that. And you can feel that that wonderful sense of alignment from the top of your crown down the back of your spine, especially into your root, from your legs to your feet. That is most excellent if you can sense that. So just see what you can do with your posture. Again, scooching in, being relaxed, pulling your chin back a little bit. And then we're going to let our awareness go into our belly, into our breath. 
so. And then inhale. In your belly. And then an exhale. <sighs> Sinking in. You take that inhale and that exhale. Your next inhale, just imagine expanding. Expanding an energy ball in your pelvis. And on your exhale, your next exhale, sink in, deepen, surrender a little more. So expand on your inhale with kind of an energy ball and it, then you're going to exhale and sink in. Inhale, expand, exhale, flow down. Inhale, imagine a light colored ball in your belly. And exhale, sink in a little more deeply, release. Now imagine, as you can keep breathing regularly, just imagine, if you will, this energy ball, this orb of light in your belly. It's like a dragon's belly. A round, perfect little dragon's belly, or big dragon's belly. And as you breathe in, just breathe in that dragon's belly. So let's e inhale. And then exhale. <sighs> Surrendering and softening. Breathe in a light with this dragon's belly. Inhale and exhale, softening always, deepening. As you inhale, you might imagine a color of your belly. Maybe it's green, maybe it's baby blue, maybe it's pink. The dragon's belly is soft and powerful. So inhale again. And exhale. Softening and deepening. This time on your exhale, we're going to we're going to focus on the exhale, and your exhale is going to take you down into your dragon tail, into your root. So let's just inhale into your belly, and exhale down that dragon tail, down your coccyx into the ground. Ah, oh, powerful dragon's tail. Inhale into that belly again, and exhale down, down into the earth. One more time. Inhaling, expanding that belly, and exhaling, surrendering down into the earth. Just pause here. Keep breathing, of course. Just pause and sink into your belly. Feel. Has anything changed? Is there more space? Is there more awareness? And 
as we continue our practice with this ball of light energy that is in our dragon's belly. The next inhale, we're going to focus on the inhale. The next inhale we take, we're going to expand into our upper body. So inhale. And all the way to the crown and exhale. <sighs> Just expanding that light ball from your root. So inhale again. All the way to the crown and exhale. Uh, down back to your root, your tail. Inhale again. And exhale. Deepening. And the next day, exhale. We're going to allow all of that light to wash from the crown into the belly downward. So inhale, expand to the crown. And exhale, uh, waterfall of light, head, neck, shoulders, arms, belly, pelvic floor. Inhale, and again, waterfall, oh, softening, deepening, letting go. One more time. Just a waterfall of light all the way down to your pelvic floor and through your tail into the earth. Pause for a moment and just notice the top half of your body is now in this orb of light that's also connected to your belly. So you might imagine your dragon's belly uh, is kind of this central point of this orb or circle and energy ball. And we're going to expand that one more time now. So this time we're going to expand that to include the lower half of our body. So on your inhale, you're going to expand all the way down to your toes. So inhale from your center, from your powerful dragon belly. Inhale. Expanding and exhale. <sighs> Legs, knees, ankles, feet. Again. Inhale. The big glorious light and exhale down again. Legs, knees, calves, feet, toes. Inhaling and exhaling from the crown to the root, to the knees, to the ankles, feet. And one more time, one massive dragon waterfall from the top of your crown and in and expand and, ex and inhale and to include your entire body. So inhale. And exhale from the crown. Ah, just release it all down into the earth. And just pause. Keep breathing, of course. <laughs> but just notice how you feel.
Has your awareness expanded to include more space within and around you? Do you feel more present in your body? And have you connected with the energy? Because that's what we've been doing with our breath. We've been connecting with our energy and moving it. So let's do one more thing. And we're going to, now that we're in that wonderful light ball, whatever color that is for you, if it has a color, and it, again, it, it, it is at originating from your big, wonderful, or tiny, cute dragon's belly, whatever it is for you, this big orb of, of light energy totally within it. We're going to expand it one more time. One more time, and we're going to include the earth. So on the inhale, inhale into your entire body, right? Your orb of light, still staying connected to your belly. And then we'll exhale, and on our exhale, we're going to move our awareness down into the earth, maybe, you know, a few inches, a few feet, whatever you feel comfortable doing, just allow it to expand. So here we go. And we're going to take a big inhale and keep it <laughs> gentle. So inhale. the way down into the ground, connecting with earth. One more inhale. Down, <sighs> crown to ground and beyond. One more time. Expanding and releasing. <sighs> down. Down. Into the earth. See if you notice again more expansion underneath your feet, especially. Do you feel more connected to the earth? Did anything change there? You can always do this several times. The first time didn't quite do it for me, so I, I did it a couple more times. So it's uh, whatever works for you. So now that you are completely in your body and connected to earth, which is a source of energy that you can draw on and also release into. Let's just kind of bring our awareness back into the body again and sense any little niggling tension or congestion or um, energy that might still be hanging around after all that. It's fine if it is, no judgment. And what we're going to do is we're going we're gonna to breathe that warm dragon breath, not the fire, unless you want the fire, but just the warm dragon breath into that area. So in your mind's eye and in your energy body, go to that place or the places where you feel a little bit not quite there yet. And if you're already here, that's great. Just like maybe go to your heart. It's a good place to breathe the warm dragon breath. So on your inhale, you're going to do the same. You're going to just expand though into that area and then release. So here we go. Inhale and exhale. Ah, warm dragon breath again. Expand. 
expand and ah, warm dragon breath. Just releasing that down into the earth. And exhale down, down deep, releasing through the bottoms of your feet into the earth. One more time. And uh, exhaling all the way down into the ground. Uh, it's like watering the soil, leaving, leaving the body, watering the soil of the earth with your energy. It just feels so yummy to be so connected and so in your energy body and so in your seat. So come back to your awareness of that belly. So powerful, your dragon belly, that tail that can root into the ground at any time through your own tail, through your own coccyx, your lower lumbar spine. And then your dragon breath, which we've been working with, your breath this whole time. Your warm dragon breath is a softening breath. It's a releasing breath. It's not a scary breath, of course. You can breathe fire when you need to. But for what we're doing here, it's a nice, warm, soft breath. The softer your breath, the more release you'll experience. And the more imagination and color and play that you can bring into your practice, as we did here with this dragon, wood dragon practice, the more fun you're going to have, the more relaxed you're going to be. And when you drop the pressure, when you drop the effort, when you drop the seriousness, you're literally uh, stepping into light. And that is the fun place. That's the place we all want to be. That's the place where we receive all the good stuff, all of the perspective, the shifts of awareness, the downloads, the vision from this space of light, not so serious, relaxed, embodied awareness. So I hope, I sincerely hope you enjoyed this practice. And uh, it's been my pleasure to do this with you today. And uh, let me know how you liked it. Really, I'd, I'd love to hear back. I'd love to hear if you'd like more of these because I literally do these every day. <laughs> and they come through me in new ways all of the time. So um, I'd, be, I'd be delighted to uh, have this experience with you on a more uh, regular basis. So thanks again. Mahalo. Have a wonderful day or evening or morning. Uh, and we'll talk again, meet again soon. <laughs>